Hey everyone, it's your boy Luis Torres, and I'm going to be using the MXR Full Bore Metal Preamp Pedal, and I'm going to be powering it with my Moore Baby Bomb 30 Watt Power Amp. This thing is a little beast of a beast. That little baby bomb, I probably have it set to the equivalent of two. It's fucking loud. I think it's really loud. Um, and the full bore, ah, you know, if my Rev G4 is 100% and I absolutely love it, then the full metal or the full bore metal preamp is a 70 it passes, it just, it just has like a weird, not a weird sound, but... I mean, I can pull out my Shure SM57 and mic it and go, you know, try to capture the, the actual audio. But just know, it's, it's, a, it's a 7 out of 10. Um, it's okay. It's good if you're starting out. I don't think that's necessarily a pedal that you would always use. If you just want something low, something that sounds okay, and you want to use it with your um, with something like the more um, Baby Bomb 30 or the... I actually realized that it's... Uh, after I did a little research, it actually is the Electro Harmonic uh, Magnum 44. 
uh, which is another pedal, and it's 44 watts that it pushes. And um, but if you're just gonna play something low and and you know you just want to hear it, that's what I think the full bore um, is for. Is it can't? I don't. I don't think that would be anyone's main sound. Um, but if you buy it, fair warning. It's almost like a little, the only thing I can kind of compare it to is the, I hate to say this, the boss metal zone. You know how it kind, how the metal zone is a little, you know, the best way to describe it, you know how it has that little B-ish feel to it? If you have the metal zone, you know exactly what I'm talking about when I say bees. This has bees in it, without question. You can't, I, you can't hear it through a, through my uh, camera button. This it's a little bees. This is bees in there. So it sounds great if it's low, and but if it's if you're trying to use it with your amp and you you know your band practice and you're pushing it at 50 watts. If you have a 50 watt amp or you know up to 75, 80 watts on a 100 watt amp, it's gonna sound like doo doo. So. 70, it's a 7. It's a 7 out of 10. Still not bad because it's a 7, um, but it's a 7. It's not a 10. The Rev G4 is a 10. The Abasi Pathos is a 10. The KHDK Paranormal is a 10. The KHDK Ghoul Screamer is a 10. Um, the MXR 10 Band EQ, which you can, you can just dial in your tone from there, is a 10. This is a seven. The amp tweaker, what's it called? Tight Metal Junior. That's a nine. So, and that sounds awesome. This is a seven. This is seven. So, if you want to get a seven, get a seven. There's a bunch of other ones that are tens. That thing, I think I paid 50 bucks for. It. So, 50 bucks for a seven, take all day. Because the Rev G4 is 225, 250. So there's, you know, you have, to, you have to consider that. So, all right. So everyone, hit the subscribe button if you haven't. You're the absolute best. Have a great weekend. And as usual, I will talk to you guys soon.